Hello everyone, this is Defense Politics Asia and a quick update from the Izum front. Izum is here, uh, the word is very small. Uh, apparently Google Map don't, don't really like them that much, they don't give them like a Mario Paul size or even a L shift size, size uh, word. Anyway, uh, if you don't know, Izum is around here. So on the Izum front, uh, the Russians have captured Studenok. Uh, this comes after uh, uh, the report that the Russians have crossed the river uh, at Yer Yeremivka and they have captured Studenok. And uh, further north, uh, there is a video coming out of the Russians uh, appearing on the Oskil Dam. And uh, that shows that they have captured the dam area. Uh, however, the Oskil Dam has been damaged. And uh, there is also uh, the capture of Oskil. So, I have reserved uh, for a very, 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 very long time uh, not to give Oskil to the Russians uh, because I really did not see information of them capturing the town. So apparently, uh, they indeed did not capture the town. So they only just captured it uh, probably these few days. And uh, I have made it uh, like under the Russian border around two, one, two weeks ago because of the number of advances uh, so far up into the front that I think that probably there will be no more Ukrainian troops here. So apparently there are U Ukrainian troops here and uh, it's some, probably something related to this uh, this report that there might be some forces uh, south of Oskil. So apparently the there's a small detachment of Ukrainian forces at Oskil and uh, they have retreated and uh, on their retreat, they also damaged the or skill them. And then uh, I'm not sure if they are still around here, but they might uh, they might find it very exciting moving down this uh this entire forest. Uh, it would be probably quite a trek uh around a thirteen kilometers trek. Are uh, they gonna be, they gonna for, uh complete this trek uh in a day? Okay, I in a day, uh thirteen kilometers isn't really that far away. Uh, you can cover that distance in a day. Uh. If you are not un, uh, under fire and uh, if you did not step on a mine uh, if you step on a mine uh, the 13 kilometers might take a uh, hundred years so so this capture of the student now also threatens uh, to cut them off so if the Russians decided to uh, uh, entrench themselves around this region and at the town uh, these guys if they exist uh, because we we this all this kind of information might be wrong so uh, if they exist, uh, they're going to have some uh, exciting times ahead uh, to travel down this uh, this forest area. So anyway, uh, this is the quick update uh, from the Izum front. Uh, Izum front. And I'll see you in the next update.